wake up. We don't have enough road to get up to 88. Roads? Where we're going, we don't need roads. Good afternoon, Sydney High. Today is Tuesday, January 15th, and here are your announcements. The next blood drive of the school year is Friday, February 8th, from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. in the small gym. Pick up your permission form with Mr. Bickle and sign up online at www.donortime.com. The registration code for students and staff is 354. Students must be at least 16 years old and weigh 110 pounds or more. All students must have a picture ID with their date of birth. Students who donate will get a free t-shirt. And all Sydney High students that donate at least three times will be able to wear red cords with their cap and gown. Students should eat a good breakfast and drink plenty of water before donating. And the Sydney girls basketball team won last night against St. Henry, 60 to 46. Leading scorers for the Jackets were Connor Harris with 29 and Lauren Elmore with 11. Excellent job, ladies. And the JV also won 45 to 43. Attention seniors, senior patron ads for the 2013 yearbook are due to Ms. Klein by March 1st. If you would like to purchase an ad that includes a message from a parent or guardian and additional pictures, pick up information outside A203 or in the office. Information was also given to you with yearbook picture information. And all seniors must return the student information form for the yearbook to Ms. Klein by March 1st. This includes your signature, correct spelling of your name, and your senior quote and all students. Yearbooks are now on sale. Pick up an order form in the office or outside A203. You can also order yours online by visiting www.jostens.com. We're approaching the last chance to buy, so get yours before it's too late. If you plan on attending the Sydney versus Lehman boys basketball game on January 19th, it will be pre-sale tickets only. You must buy your ticket in the athletic office prior to January 18th. If you have an athletic pass, you will need to see Miss Williams to get your ticket. There will be no passes accepted at the door. Overdue book, what's your excuse? Mrs. Nikolai is currently holding a contest for students who have overdue library books. Simply return an overdue book and ask Mrs. Nikolai for an entry ticket. All you have to do is write your name and your excuse as to why you didn't return your book on time. Winners will be drawn Friday, January 25th, so don't hesitate, bring on the excuses. Jacket pack t-shirts are now in. If you ordered one, please see Mr. Dungis. Any student wanting to take the February 9th ACT must have their packet postmarked by January 11, 2013. Please see Mrs. Barton if you have questions. The Ohio State University at Lima is hosting a day to learn more about the first year engineering program. It will be Tuesday, February 5th, 2013. Please see your counselor for more details. The reserve wrestling team competed in Mason tournament Saturday. Second place finishers were Chris Contrail, Seth Haver, Luke Dollinghouse, Rhett Rosengarten, and Jeremiah, Jeremiah Slagle, and Jack Beatty. The reserve squad will compete in the Sydney tournament held at the middle school this Saturday. The varsity will travel to Alliance this weekend for the Top Gun tournament. Good luck to those wrestlers. Um, attention seniors, the following colleges will be visiting SHS. This is an excellent opportunity to learn more about various colleges, programs, and the application process. Sign up in the guidance office if you are interested in learning about more than one of these schools. The University of Toledo will be visiting February 5th, 2013 at 8.30 a.m. in the guidance conference room. And we have an app of the day for you. Uh, today, today's app of the day is Llama or Duck. Try to see if you can beat my high score, 60. 
And we have a quote of the day coming to you from Samantha Fote. All right, for your quote of the day, I've got it for you. Before you criticize someone, you should walk a mile in their shoes. That way, when you criticize them, you're a mile away from them. And you still have their shoes. <laughs> have a good day, Sydney. <laughs>